In question two, you've been asked to write down the rule for generating the following sequences using a difference equation. First up, we did look at this earlier, of course, as an arithmetic sequence, which just gives the term in, in terms of the initial and the difference. And that's the way in which we can predict. Now, as a recursive, we are dealing with this situation for an arithmetic sequence. I'll say I've got my first term in this case is 8. The common difference is 7. So we can write that as follows. Tn plus 7. Now our calculator handles this and handles this particularly well. So I'm on the recursive. Still got stuff there from earlier workings by the looks of it. And I've got a choice of dealing with the initial or the first term. I'll make that the first term. So in this case, I've got an, we'll have to do, that's the, the uh, terms they use, plus 7. And I start with 8. Tick the box. And you can see the sequence generated in form of a difference equation. So I go to 8. 15, and so on. So difference equation relates the previous number or term with the next one. So next one is equal to previous plus the number. Now looking at C, you should be able to see the common difference here is equal to 4. Our starting term, or T1, is equal to 14. So Tn plus 1 is equal to Tn plus 4. Please notice I will tend to bounce around a little bit between capitals and lowercase. So there's no hard and fixed rules about this. In the case of E, the difference is minus 5. My first term is 5. So Tn plus 1 is Tn minus 5 with the first term equaling 5. 